Turning now to a story of giving back this holiday season. We are so grateful to the many groups and organizations that are helping make the holidays happen for man, for families across Metro Atlanta. But one group takes a different approach to ensure kids get those presents under the tree. That's right. So Liza Lucas takes us to South Atlanta to shop and shares one volunteer special reason for supporting others this Christmas. Surrounded by signs of the Christmas spirit, you'll find Betty Maddox. Every year I come, I be right here dealing till they can't wait till it open up. This space full of toys is not a store, but meant to feel that way. Pride for Parents is our annual pop-up shop that we get to host in beautiful South Atlanta. Uh, it's about as old as the organization itself. Pamela Springfield is with Focused Community Strategies. The nonprofit's Pride for Parents event is intended to be a little different. Instead of handing out presents, families get the chance to shop for loved ones for gifts within their means. We host this beautiful space where families can come in and do just that, purchase brand new toys at a price point that's affordable for them. The group's motive is not just about building holiday magic, but building community, with neighbors like Miss Betty pitching in. You see the prices on this truck. Knowing the joy kids get from Christmas is why this grandmother gives back. The kid was the right of my life. Ooh. She loved Christmas. That's how she loved her Christmas. Miss Betty's granddaughter passed away a few years ago, but 14 year old Jakira's love of Christmas she holds close to her heart. So I volunteer just for her. She loved toys. And helping her community and other children is part of her healing. And the help doesn't stop at the holidays. Proceeds from Pride for Parents cycle right back into the community, providing jobs and more in the adjoining Carver Market. It pays salaries, it provides produce at an affordable rate for us. So as parents shop for gifts, there's a reminder in the air that the real present can't be opened, only felt. They come in and they be so excited. It's like, you know, it's just like little kids all over again. The children, the community, what it's really all about. Miss Betty, one of the 130 volunteers who helped make this pop up possible, and that doesn't count for the more than 60 toy drives hosted around the city, helping keep shelves stocked. This is also just one initiative for Focus Community Strategies. This group works year round serving South Atlanta. And it's so true. So many people do really need help. We have seen inflation. We have seen issues with net benefits, so there are a lot of families that are struggling this time of year, yeah. but they still want to make it special for their families, just like everyone does. And shout out to all the volunteers who come mm -hmm. in and pitch in and make it happen. Like, we see the work, yeah. we see you doing the work, and it just makes everybody's day a little bit better to see that.